right, next up, we have one more um, new member who I'm very excited um, to introduce, um, Nate Conroy from STEM Hero. And he's warned us that through the working from home, he has a couple of kids running around. So if you hear some kids in the background, I'm sure you're all sympathetic. <laughs> hey, Tia, can you hear me okay? I can, thanks, Nate. Yeah, I just I just uh, successfully started a mid-morning um, bathtub routine so the, the second grader is watching the two-year-old, so we should be fine for five minutes. <laughs> Hopefully people can, it's a water efficient bath, uh, don't worry. Um, so I'm, I'm Nate Conroy, um, I'm a teacher. This is a, a picture of me a couple years ago actually doing a pilot of a simple idea, which was can we make math more relevant to young people by engaging them with real world data. So this is on the south side of Milwaukee, um, highly impoverished school, about 90% Latino. We taught kids how to take visual reads of meters. And to our surprise, some of them went home and for upwards of 120 straight days, they took data readings um, off, of their, off of their meters. And this caught the attention of researchers at Marquette University and Loyola University Chicago who did a randomized controlled study of our program and indeed found that we can help close the STEM gap. In other words, we can get more young people interested in math and science related careers if we engage them with real, real, real world data. Um, what's happened is actually as we've gotten connected with the Alliance for Water Efficiency and CalWAP, we've come to understand that utilities have data. Specifically, they have data coming off of meters and they have portals. And so our goal is, and our belief is that these utility portals should be leveraged to help close that STEM gap, to get more young people interested in math and science careers. Go ahead, Tia. So what we do is we partner with utilities. Um, a couple CalWEP members to highlight here, um, Rancho California, uh, City of Sacramento uh, Water Utility, and we make their web portals the center of a math and science unit that gets implemented at the upper middle school grades. Um, I was actually hoping to call in from a teacher training in Temecula that we have this week uh, with Sylvia down at Rancho California, but I'm at home instead. Um, but, uh, you know, this is what we do. We're seeing um, a lot of enthusiasm from teachers who have a real need uh, to make math relevant, and they have standards, the next generation science standards there in California, as well as the California um, environmental principles that they need to meet. And this can be a, um, a great way to do it at the middle school level. As you can see with the Sacramento example there, we also link it to existing rebates and social media and things. Um, this is a tool that we know is effective in terms of engaging those hard to reach families um, and giving them a way to get to know your utility, get to know your web portal um, and sign up for things like leak alerts. Uh, next. Um, if you want to, you know, we, we're really, we're nice people and we like doing phone calls. So happy to send you more information about the program. Uh, this is something specifically that we do with an effort. Uh, the teachers lead this, so this isn't something that's going to burden your staff. And we can provide reporting and um, show you how effective it is. Um, I will say that, uh, please be a little patient. Um, these days, we're actually launching a giveaway. We launched a giveaway providing this leak uh, detection activity as something that parents who are staying at home with their kids can do. We've gotten requests from over half the states and Wales and Albania. So we're trying to do our part by supporting teachers and families uh, stuck at home and um, having them find and fix leaks as a, as a especially appropriate activity during this time. So if you reach out, we might be a little slow getting back to you, but we hope to talk more. Thanks to you. That's awesome, Nate. How timely. Thank you so much. And uh, your kids did great.